Okay, we're going to try something a little bit different today. I just finished wiring up this M185 sequencer. I installed the chips. It's got a whole bunch of nasty hard do wiring on the back here and I hope it all works. I don't know. I have a suspicion that if it doesn't work you won't be seeing this. But if you do, it's because it works. First power up. I've never never plugged this in before. We're going to see what happens. Alright, we've got sort of a cheesy power connection here. This is a QPSA from Synthesizers.com that I repurposed for this because I was out of the normal kind of adapter I use. I think it'll work. spot in this cabinet is kind of tight anyway. Let's get it in there. Here we go. We're getting up there. Yeah. It's close enough for travel. All right, let's plug it in and see what happens. Hey, I'm getting lights. Look at that. Wow. goes fast. That's as fast as it goes. The tempo knob. And uh, that's as slow as it goes. Hey, it works. I think I like that. Stops. Next, next. That seems to be working. Previous is working. Alright. Okay, and the next cycles all the way down and it keeps on going. Previous just goes to the first one and stops. I wonder if that's how it's supposed to be. I don't really know. Don't know yet. Alright. We got flashing lights. Yay. We got set it for eight. Let's set it down to like five. That works. Four. Hey, that works. Uh, let's see. Okay, good. That's working. Is it for that? Excellent. Well, let's see if we get some um, control voltages coming out of it. Let's see. Got the E three fifty sitting next to this. I got it plugged in. We're gonna want the CV out. Port Mendes turned it up, turned down, good. Hey, the port works good, that's good. I don't have the gates hooked up yet, so we can't. Now, let's see if the gates work. Uh, let's see. 